God say about being gay? In sacred scriptures anyway. Leviticus. Gay copulation in God's eyes. Abomination. Chapter 18, 22. Doomed if they don't and damned if they do. Chapter 20, verse 13. A tad more tough. A mite more mean. When men are drawn to know more men, God's law is clear. Go kill them then. Now Romans 1 verse 26 says God's up to some nasty tricks. For those who from the fold depart, he puts gay feelings in their heart. So let's review these old ideas, thoughts entwined guilt and fears, reflecting mindsets long ago, when ancient peoples didn't know how they then defined their gods, was superstitious and at odds with what we now begin to see through science and technology, divine design, an entity that envelopes eternity. The deity that drives the bus radiates in each of us, in all we are, in all we do, in us, through us, as us too. And then let's reevaluate the notions that those old books state, with good and bad as black and white. They never really got it right. When we are drawn to one another, be it sister, be it brother, filled with feelings to unite and dwell together in delight. That union's blessed.